This is part two of my Fallout Tale of Two Wastelands highlight reel. This one will cover the things I do in the Mojave Wasteland. And my next video project after this, I'm going to start a playthrough of Outward. So I hope you enjoy. <laughs> what kind of ropes did he use here. on me? Why can't I break free of them? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? How are you supposed to kill me? You made your you going gambling game. after here? Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling... That thing can't hurt me. Run of bad luck. Truth is... The game was rigged from the start. You're awake. How about that? I feel somewhat better. <laughs> Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. How did me taking a nine millimeter round of the head do that? I've taken way bigger hits. What I get shot with a duranium bullet? Surprised anybody would want to tangle with you. Heck, you could go deathclaw hunting with a switch. But try not to get killed anymore. Well, now I'm kind of embarrassed. And not because I'm just in, st stuck in my underwear. I've completed the quest. Ain't that a kick in the head? Yeah, somehow a single 9mm bullet put Blazer down. <laughs> Makes no sense when you think about it. First, we'll take this guy out. <laughs> I've got a fragmented symbol on my pit boy. See if I can use a stealth boy to be disappear completely. I got AFK Phase Swaglord's head. Still burning. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. Yeah, there's guys with the uh, magic guns that shoot bullets that can actually put me down and force me to be hospitalized for a couple days. Uh, it sounds like I do need some help. Uh, she gave me a varmint rifle. I already equipped it for me. All right, it's kind of like the BB gun back when I was ten. That's the right idea. Look down the sight. Yeah, I can do this. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Nice shot. I'm on my way. I will save you. There's too many! Well, not for long. I've gained the animal control perk, rank two. See if I can save her without hitting her. Oh yeah. And me. There you are. <laughs> well, I got their attention, that's for sure. And they're armed with a fat man. Whoa, heads up. Let's see how you like this. <laughs> That's right, I can take you in a straight fight. Why is there a guy cowering over here? What happened, buddy? Something go wrong when you're trying to make your healing powder? Hello? Can you help me? <laughs> well, that depends. What do you need help with? My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge, and I can't get to her. Please, she's going to die. All right, sure, I'll help her out. Where is she? Go up the path, past the broken radio tower, and go to the right. They're at the top of the trail. I don't see any girl anywhere. Sorry I tricked you, but thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there, after I deal with you. You mean the stash already looted? Oh, by the way, you stopped on my plasma mine. 
<laughs> oh, that was great. He stopped right on top of it to let me know it was a trap, and then he exploded. Little did he know I set the counter trap for him. There's a leader, although I don't think the leader is the one that has what I want. What the heck? Whoever did that's gonna regret it. I think it was you. Why are you running? Think you can escape? I disagree. I think this pile of guts is the one that has what I want. I think I woke everyone up. Yep. Throwing grenades at me. Down you go. Another mercenary. There it is. You might have noticed the weapon he's holding. That's the YCS 186. That's the weapon I came here for. I'll just be taking that. Let's see if the surprise I left for the Powder Gangers actually comes into play. They coming? Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh yeah, I put some mines down there. I got an alien blaster. This will stop him. Bottle cap mine blew him apart as he was being disintegrated. The password is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> That's the dumbest password I've ever heard. Like anyone who cares will ever read this. I don't worry, Raul, I care. If by some chance you want to find me again, and if by some even greater chance the coyotes haven't picked my bones clean, I'll be at my shack. I'll just use dynamite. Works good for, against the coyotes for me. If that doesn't work, just throw one off the nearest cliff. That's yeah, clearly not there. The case has been broken into. Wonder if Prim Slim knows anything about that. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. Did you notice that Vance's gun is missing? Just mosey on over to the display case and you'll see it plain as day. Might have pinched that gun. Mint condition. Never fire. Uh, I think you better scan your data registry. <laughs> well, look at that. I happened to cross this data file locked away in an isolated subsystem. There we go. Prim Slim's corrupted memory block. What are we thinking? We're gonna get ourselves killed. Look. Tell Sammy to give you the gun, all right? Just take it. I don't want it around tempting us to do something stupid. There we go. I knew you'd see reason. Bye. You heard her, Sammy. Give me the gun. This better be good, stranger. Yeah, your wife told me to give me the gun. Really? Oh, thank God. I love that woman, but I swear this time she was going to get us killed. I don't think I can just turn the gun back into them and they can put it on the display case. I'll just do it myself. There we go. Now the gun's back. Always good to see you, partner. Yeah, I gave you back the gun. Happy trails, partner. That's an interesting name. Yeah, I'm sure you're definitely not cheating. Here we go. <laughs> One shot, one kill. Check out how big he is compared to Blazer. <laughs> I took out a giant. Who's shooting now? Looks like there's two people up ahead, although it looks like they're shooting at each other. Well, they were. One of them's running away. They aren't hostile to me. What's going on? Jacqueline. He's crazy. Please help me. Well, let me go find out about this. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna need to ask you to stop shooting her. 
I'm helping. helping. Karma, karma for it. I can't, the girl was calling for help. What's wrong? Why are you looking at me like that? You, you stole, stole that cap necklace, necklace from that poor man. So what if I did? What are you going to do about it? I'm going to see that justice is done. That's what, I'm a superhero. Not if I kill you first. Oh, you, you think, think you can? can? Sucker. <laughs> <laughs> Knocked her down with that punch. punch. Anyway, die. Anyway, Ranger Ghost said there'd be people in the town if... What the heck is that? What do you need? I need you to stop singing, <laughs> yellow bucket. Let's see if I can see him from here. There he is, the legendary Deathclaw. Is he getting up? That'll get his attention. Got him. There he is. Here's Fruity Bird, also part of the Fallout 76 experience. <laughs> if Briscoe is going to wonder why two uh, spacemen are fist fighting in his store. <laughs> Hit him so hard he fell into the stairway. Yeah, I'm going to outbox you, Fruity Bird. You're not going to get into space. Besides, you don't want to go to space. There's aliens up there, and they're way too big spaceships. That's right, you are. Hiya! Uh, <laughs> you are hit, that is true. You're going to say that every time I punch you. That's right. I've actually been to space, Fruity Bird. How about you? Down he goes. Uh, come with me. There's something you should see in front of the dinosaur. Okay, if that's what you think. And down she goes. Kaboom! Whee! <laughs> Now we can sneak up on him, put a C4 in his pocket, take out the detonator, push the button, and blow him sky fucking high! Yeah! Ho oh. ho! Hello, motor runner. Don't mind me, doggies. You keep sitting in your chair, I just want to use a stealth boy. Just like with the uh, Cook Cook, we're gonna pickpocket motor runner. Plant a C4 plastic explosive onto his person. Sneak over here. Come on over here, Veronica. We're gonna push the detonator and blow motor runner sky fucking high! Yeah! Check this out, though. We're gonna use, uh, one of these turbos I've picked up. This slows down time. Now I can just dash straight up to it. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? I took turbo and ran straight up. Jumping Jesus on a pogo stick. You're the first one to make it through alive, let alone manage a return trip. These guys have orders from Caesar himself to kill me on sight. They see me standing here over several of their dead buddies, and their reaction to me is... Give me God, I think I've already done that. Let's see if any of them care if I start planting bombs around them.
That's right. Pay no attention to the bombs I'm leaving around you. The C4 plastic explosives. Let's see how many of them I just blow away right now. <laughs> At present, my best guess for finding the items would be to search any of the old vaults in the area. Those vaults were usually built much like these military bunkers, even using the same contractors in their constructions at times. I'll mark the vault's locations on your map. Best of luck to you. If I look at the map, I can see here that near Camp Forlorn Hope and Nelson is an abandoned Brotherhood of Steel bunker. Well, maybe I can find the differential pressure controller and the HEPA cartridges in here, huh? What the? What's going on? Ah! Stop! Oh, what the heck? Where am I? What's going on? Are you listening? Good. From now on, when I talk, listen, and follow my instructions. Play stupid. Play clever. Make the mistake of saying no. That collar on your neck will go off and take your head with it. Well, how did I get here? <laughs> get here? You walk into one of my traps in the Mojave, following the Sierra and Madre signal. Now, you're here with that collar on your neck. It's like that pit boy on your wrist, except filled with explosives. A little radio of the old world. Just needed some tune. Do what I said, and the collar will go off. Refuse, try and run, disobey me, I'll kill you and find someone else. There's no escape from here until I let you go. The sooner you accept your situation, the better. I went into that bunker to find some things to fix the Hidden Valley bunker, but... I stumbled into some kind of trap. Let's see, this gate leads directly to the Sierra Madre Casino. Once in, I may not be able to return to the villa. Why would I want to stay in the villa, get into the casino? Alright, finally, I got the... Oh, not again! Why? Come on! Ugh. Ugh. You know, it's really hard to do what you ask of me when I keep getting gassed. Vera's outfit added. Can I put it on? The name's Bond. James Bond. Die, Elijah! Taste my superheated cosmic knife! Down he goes! Time to get out of here! There, what do you have to say now, Elijah? Now that I've killed you, and have stopped whatever plans you had for the Mojave using the Nightmarish traps and items in here. Fully integrated security technotronic officer active and reporting for duty. That sure is a mouthful. Let's shorten that to Fisto. We'll name you after that old, uh, pneumatic gauntlet I had back in the Capital Wasteland before I replaced it with love and hate. Yes, sir. Fisto reporting for duty. Please assume the position. Excuse me? <laughs> no way. I am programmed for your pleasure. Please assume the position. I don't think so. I don't even like robots, let alone in that way. Lupa, this is Crewman Terius Pikus. Over. Go ahead, Pikus. Afternoon patrol enters Fiend territory at 1300. Have them mind that stretch. 10-4, Pikus. Fiends will be alerted. Roger, Lupa. What's the status of your primary mission, Pikus? Charges are set. Detonation will occur as the train leaves. Charges. The oh, train. I gotta hurry. I see the bomb. Here we go. This device looks as though it's armed. It could go off at any moment. Let's defuse it. 
There we go. I've defused and extracted the bomb. Time to go back to what Dad taught me as a baby, to pick up objects and carry them with Z. Check it out, Ranger Morales is a zombie. Oh, brains. And he's, uh, he apparently walks backwards as a zombie. Anyway, here you go. I brought him back. I don't believe it. Who the hell are you, man? How did you just walk right up and pull him out of there? <laughs> I just did what anybody else would have done, really. Oh, bullshit. What anybody else would have done is get their asses killed. You're leading some kind of charmed life. If you change your mind, come find me on the casino floor. In the meantime, the presidential is yours whenever you want it. Adios. Hold on there, I got something for you. <laughs> well, too bad for Benny, I still have all my guns. There's one in particular I want. Let's see if I can get it off him. There we go. I'll pick up his gun. If you pick right back up. Oh well, I tried. I put on my winterized power armor, because we're going to try out Pushy on some worthy targets. There they are up ahead. You might remember these guys. It's the DWK clan. Killer76 took them out with his sniper rifle, which was an anti-material rifle with a silent scope. But I've got R.K. Gannon with me. On we go. I think she's already dead. Down he goes. That'll be enough of your missile launcher. No, but your boss has. <laughs> See if I can send him flying with an uppercut. There he goes. Woo! <laughs> Outstanding. In fact, I think that's it right there. Get up my detonator. See if I blow him up. Where is it going? Hey! Don't go that way. Here it is, the legendary Cazador. Ice to see you. And that's the second legendary creature down. Oh, who's this guy? Oh. I no scoped JFK. Taste my laser vision. Be Raul alone. There we go. Yeah, I'll bet. There's the legendary fire gecko. Take that. Down it goes. That's four out of five legendary creatures. Okay, here we go. This is a banana yucca. Pick it up since I think I might need it. Here we go. That's fine. It's fine. Oh, they're mad. What are you doing, hey? Chalk, stop! I didn't kill it, it was follows Chalk! I got an idea. Where's my self boy? He's still shooting them, hey! He tells me not to kill the big horners, and then he goes and does it. <laughs> oh, come on, really? <laughs> the guy who gave me the quest is also going to be the one responsible for me failing it. Whoa, what the? Ah, here we go again. I can't see. What the? The ghost of she is a... It's a Yawagwai, I think. Although it looks like it's got a Super Saiyan aura. Oh my 
my flaming sword still working on it. Oh. I win? Oh boy. I think I won. Where'd those other ones go? Why is there a cricket chirping noise in the casino? You got some big crickets in here. It's now or never. Let's go. All right, everyone. We just have to walk right out and make it not look as inconspicuous as possible. I bet he's at Camp McCarran, breathing easy now that the Fiend's leader is dead. Oh, I wonder what smooth talking, handsome rogue must have dealt with the Fiend's leader. Look, friend, don't get near me. You're too well respected for my business. Uh, I wasn't even trying to talk to you, Mr. Holdout. <laughs> That was weird. I don't know why he interrupted. Mr. Holdout, is that you? Why are you stopping me from going into the Gomorrah to tell me that you can't do business with me? And why are you in a bush? I wish he'd leave me alone. I think the authorities should see these tapes I found in your safe. I think I should kill you before you have a chance to show those tapes to anyone. What do I have to lose? You mean besides your life? <laughs> I'm not giving you these tapes. They're evidence of a crime. I guess you've made your choice, then. Time to die. Is that so? That, that fancy gun, gun you got ain't gonna save you. Fatality. Take a seat on the couch so we can get to talking. Alrighty, then. So I assume you know why we called you here. Well... I hear you lost some guns. Yeah, we lost some guns, you little weasel. However, we can get more guns. You slowed us down, but you can't stop us. You're gonna die of failure. Mr. Bond, as a last request, will you tell me more about your plan? Are you shitting me? You didn't even know what the plan was. Yeah. As a last request, I guess we can give you that courtesy. Well, Nero didn't tell me about any of this when he convinced me to take you out. The fuck? I knew there had to be someone higher up helping you. Nero, you backstabbing, two-timing motherfucker. I knew this day would come. <laughs> I think Nero just took him out right away. He was planning it all along, and I didn't even know that. You sure are. Oh, this isn't good. The investigator's dead. Jay Barnes. Take his matchbook. Hey, who are you guys? Why are these guys attacking us? Here, I was talking about how polite they are, and what happens? Two of them run in with dress canes and try to kill us. I think someone's showing up now. Who's this? It's not 4 p.m. yet. I think that guy's trying to take a seat. Veronica, you're in his way. Could you not give him a lap dance while I talk to Chauncey? Let's plan on meeting again as soon as... Wait, did you hear something? Were you followed? Hmm? Who's this guy? An assassin? Don't mind me, guy, sitting over there in the sauna. I just have to kill this assassin that's shooting at me. There we go. You alright there, Veronica? Rrrr. Rrrr. It's alright. Fighting's over. I think. Well, Mr. Assassin, it looks like it was too hot for you to hang out in here. Fellow members of the White Glove Society, bon appetit. Well, surprise is on him. I can prove it's not human flesh. What the? Who is this trespasser? Actually, I'm not a trespasser. I'm, uh, I'm being sponsored. Anyways, bad news, Mortimer. Nobody's eating the boy you kidnapped tonight. What are you... Why is he there? Who are we eating right now? Sorry, Mortimer. Secret recipe. It's not human flesh, though. I can promise you that. No! These are lies. I never kidnapped anyone. And even if I did, there's no harm done. He's alive, after all. 
It's too late, Mortimer. You've already said too much. You're all hypocrites. How can you claim to be connoisseurs yet deny yourselves the greatest of all meats? I am ashamed to have once called everyone here family. This isn't over, though. I'll begin anew. The White Glove Society will never achieve the greatness of my new order. You'll all hear from me again. We'll be hearing from him again when he forms his new club, the Society of the Purple People Eaters. That is one big boat bloat fly. That got its attention. Fire at its wing. Shooting bolts of plasma at me. Agitated yet, bug boy? It's time for you for you to go down. I am the Slayer of Legends. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. To me. Should I summon my minions? Yes, my minions. I'll trash them like I did your giant piece of junk downstairs. Oh, now you've done it. I feel a twinge of regret over that little mistake I left on. Minions, destroy this intruder! Hmm. Or perhaps make it more dramatic. Minions! To me! <laughs> oh yes, that's quite a bit better. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like the only one that got stung was Dr. Mobius. I found my brain. Now you and I are going to settle things. I recommend watching your tone with me, you bottomite. Now, your brain. Hand it over, or we'll extract it again. You may have noticed the pacification field is down. Guess what happens now? A uh, fight? I, I've never been in a fight. What, uh, what, what, what do I... Colleagues! Think tank! Alert! Alert! We are under attack! That's right you are, let's go! <laughs> Looks like you guys are all done... thinking. You're the courier who caused so much trouble for my legion. And yet you dare come before me. All the bribes I sent to the Omertas ended up buying me nothing. The Great Khans aren't exactly clamoring to fight for my legion now. The garrison I established at Nelson has been wiped out. Years of meticulous scheming to place a mole at Camp McCarran. Wasted. So tell me this, because I really want to know. I am feared with good reason. But you, of all people, Dare to come here and stand before me, the mighty Kaisar. What were you thinking? <laughs> wow, when you put it out like that. Yeah, I have really have been a thorn in your side, haven't I? Arcade, I know you said you don't want me helping out the Legion, but this isn't much better. 
I'd rather uh, not have a robot army take over the Mojave. So as much as I hate to say it, I gotta side with Caesar on this one. This place needs to be destroyed. Hmm. Strangely, House of Securitrons aren't attacking me. And don't mind me. <laughs> House must not know I've destroyed his gadgets. Yep, here we go. Bye bye, Jane. Luckily, I already turned in all the snow globes in the Mojave. There's only one left to get. And I, once I get it, I'll automatically add it to the collection and get the 2,000 caps. So no worries there. Your services are no longer required, Jane. What's this up ahead? This must be Mr. House. Alright, you don't want to come out and talk to me, huh? Unseal LS Chamber. Microbial Infection Risk. Proceed? Yes. Now let's see what Mr. House really looks like. Like an ancient dried up old mummy. Why have you done this? Centuries of preparation. So much good undone. That's a robot army. I don't like robots. Uh, I wasn't about to let you or anybody else get their hands on one. Anyways, uh. Hey, Mr. House, have you ever played that game, Bioshock? Hi, I won't be turning my, uh, weapons in this time. Who's next? Oops, I don't think that was actually a legionary. I think I killed a caravaner by mistake. He was in the camp, a uh, necessary casualty, right, Boone? Who else wants to die? Coming through, Siri. Ah, this, this takes me back. Back, back to, to that, that time, time I wiped out Paradise Falls single-handedly. Single Although this time, now I have a cyber dog and an NCR first recon sniper to help me. <laughs> hey, Caesar. Catch. Got him. There it is. Got even a god king can bleed, which is to cripple Caesar's head with a throwing spear. <laughs> Alright, time to go for a swim. As you can see, the rebreather allows my O2 level to stay at maximum even while I'm swimming underwater. And I breathe like Darth Vader while I'm underwater, apparently. Here's the crashed B-29. Now we will use the Force to attach the ballast. This appears to be a good location to attach one of the deployable ballast packages. Yes, we will. Do not overestimate the power of these ballasts. The ability to raise a plane from the water is pales in comparison to the power of the Force. Beast, huh? What's he armed with? A shoulder-mounted machine gun. <laughs> there we go. Man, Annabelle left nothing left of Beast. Tis Beauty who slayed the Beast. No, it was a missile launcher. The Divide couldn't stop me, the Mojave can't kill me. And, and nothing, nothing in the capital, capital wasteland, wasteland could slow me down, down. Not, not even the enclave. enclave. What, what chance do you think you have? I'll finish history's work 
And if the divide couldn't kill you, perhaps these spears of the old world can. Let's end this courier. You and I, here with the old world flag as witness. Well, if that's what you want. Are you gonna throw a flashbang at me at this range? That would be a mistake there. Let's see how you like Gehenna. Oh, it's settled. Oh, you got your own EDEs. Bye bye. This would be the fun part. Oh, hello, Marked Man Ravager. What are you doing here? Whoa, they explode into goo. I should be able to change the missile's target, accelerate the countdown to launch the missiles. No, I want to cancel the launch. No more missiles are getting launched out of this place. The abort code is encrypted with an incredibly advanced pre-war military encryption sequence. You'd have to be a crowd-breaking robot to crack it in time. Well, it's a good thing I got EDE with me. Cancel the launch, do it now! EDE's enhanced sensors perk. Well, that's because EDE's been destroyed. Alright, we're done here. Time to get out. This whole place is coming down. At the end of the struggle, only one courier remained in the heart of the Divide. The true courier. Courier 6. Hello, Colonel Moore. You don't mind if I sit here and wait with you? for the president's vertebrae to arrive. Pretty sure Rex and Boone aren't standing directly under where it's about to land. Yeah, we're good. That must be the president. And there's another engineer. What is it, Rex? Is there a problem here? My dog here doesn't seem to like you. Well, that's too bad. I'm just here to enjoy the show, so if you don't mind... Maybe I should go get the MPs. Bad idea. Die, infidel! Aha! Oh! <laughs> Well, good work, Boone. This guy had the redundant failsafe detonator. I gotta examine the vertebrate before you leave, Mr. President. I search the vertebrate and notice a strange item that doesn't belong. Upon examination, I notice it's a bomb. That's what he put on it when he approached. So I'm gonna disable the bomb and take it off the vertebrate. It's alright, Mr. President. We're all clear now. I guess he's leaving. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, that was pretty easy. Good boy. Here's the pressure release valve. Let's throw it. <laughs> pretty sure this isn't what the Legion had in mind when they said they wanted the waters of the Hoover Dam to flow red. And who are you to come before me? You bear the insignia of the bear. Yet you do not wear it as a soldier of the West wears it. Hold on a second. Is Caesar giving you orders beyond the grave? I mean, I did throw uh, some spears at his head and took him out. Kaisar's will is the will of the Legion and the West. All beneath the flag of the Great Bear exist to test the strength of the Legion. The West shall fall as the East fell, 
and all the tribes that stretch to the setting sun shall bear the mark of the Legion. Yeah, whatever, whatever you say, say Darth Vader, Vader. I'm, I'm here, here to kill you. you. The Legion's advance ends here. Enough words, then. Let our strength settle this. Oh, I agree. By the way, uh, Lucius taught me how to do this. <laughs> that Legion Assault punched him so hard he went up the hill. Oh, he knocked me down. Get up. Oh, he's running, though. Wait, what the... He died up here? <laughs> I guess he tried to retreat and didn't. All right, which one of you guys took him out? Was it you, Boone? <laughs> I'm guessing it was. Thanks again for watching my video, and I'll see you for the next one. Next up will be Outward Part 1.